What's going on everyone? I apologize for the current state of the video and audio. He's apologizing for me. Actually. I'm apologizing for Taylor because she made a very terrible sin today. And uh, she did not grab the memory card to put it into the camera for us to vlog tonight here at Magic Kingdom. So now we have to go make one of the worst purchases that you should never make when you come to Disney. You should never, ever, ever, ever buy a memory card from Disney. Ever. All right, so this is why you never make this kind of purchase here because they have two options. You can either get a 16 gigabyte or you can get a 32. You can probably buy a 16 gigabyte memory card for your camera for like, I don't know, 10 or $15 at Walmart or on Amazon, maybe even cheaper, it might be a little bit more. This 16 gigabyte card is $40. And it's not even like, it's not even like a good card. So certain memory cards have classes. We usually use a very high class memory card. This is garbage, but we need it. All right, we are switching to the big camera now. Yeah. Camera switch, we got a memory card in there. I think it sounds like Wishes might be getting ready to go off. I think it's Wishes. Called, yeah, Wishes. Happily Ever After, whatever it's called. I think it's we still have an hour, right? It's, it's like 7.45. The park doesn't close till 10. So we're going to do some really uh, out of the ordinary things tonight. We're doing... We're doing some different things. You'll see. We'll just see. All right, I guess we'll just see. All right, so if you guys didn't know, Pirates is actually closing for refurbishment. Pirates is closing for refurbishment on the 26th, which is this Monday, and it's supposed to be bringing the new redheaded woman scene, which is and getting the, rid of the we want the redhead, which has been a ton of controversy. So we wanted to get in and ride it one more time just to see it and get a little video of it. We are about to go do something that we have not done since 2013. You'll see. like this ride the most out of all attractions in Walt Disney World. We haven't been on this in forever. This is an attraction that when they announced it would, when there were rumors that this would potentially go away to be replaced by Tron, Tron I was like, do it. So the first time I think I rode this was back in 2013. And I actually had thought that these cars went a lot faster than what they do. And to my disappointment, they go quite slow. I'm floored it right now. <laughs> I'm not even sure how without this gimbal 
And even with this gimbal, I don't even think any of this video is actually smooth. This is really rough. I just want you to take a look at what this says on the sign over here. Right there. That says 220 miles an hour. I thought, I thought we were going that fast. I say that that is complete false advertising. I think it is an opening day attraction. So I'd be curious to th see like what other people think. But I mean, in my opinion, if there's one ride that could definitely go, besides, there's two rides that I, two attractions in Walt Disney World that I'm like, if they were gone tomorrow, I would not care. And is it the two that we're riding? No, teacups oh. are fine. Oh. Tomorrowland Speedway and the Little Mermaid. Oh my gosh, this show. Show in Hollywood in Studios. Studios. Oh. Nix them both, get them out of here. Yeah. Replace them with something better. But what does everybody else think? Because I'd be curious to know. We're doing this next. I'm sick already. I Well, I think that's about going to do it here for us at Magic Kingdom. We really just wanted to come over tonight just to relax, ride a couple of rides that we usually never ever ride, especially the Tomorrowland Speedway. Uh, only my second time ever riding it. And we've been coming now for, I've been coming now for almost 10 years. Taylor's behind me getting a drink of water. But lessons learned, try to never ever forget a memory card because Disney will upcharge you like crazy and uh, you don't want to have to pay $40 or whatever to get a memory card. But here's another tip, if you're using a camera like ours, the Sony, um, you can actually change your recording your recording settings. So instead of recording at a higher bit rate, we can record at a lower bit rate and get more video. So the normal rate that we usually record at, we only would have gotten maybe 30 minutes out of this 16 gigabyte card. But since we changed the uh, recording, hopefully the quality is still pretty decent. He just took my second water. Changing that setting gave us, uh, took us from 30 minutes up to two hours. So pretty decent. Uh, we'll see what it looks like when we get home. Should be fine though. Oh, look at the trees twinkling. Sometimes it's just nice to be able to come over and just- Enjoy the park. Just kind of enjoy the park and do whatever you want to do. Note to self. Don't forget your memory card.